Hi, this is Risha Bajpayee. I am working in Cloud Analogy as a Salesforce Technical Lead. And I am a Salesforce Platform Developer, one certified developer. Um, this is our organization's website. So we are a team of 100 plus team members and we have some products on App Exchange as well. And uh, we are working mostly working for the end clients to provide them the service. So we have some good reviews of the clients here in our website as well. And this is the structure of our website. Like we have completed, completed almost 100 plus projects and we are cert 12 certified resources who are working currently in cloud and logging. And we have six plus products on App Exchange. And this is all about the organization and uh, I am here to demo you something which uh, a project on which I have worked on for a client. So basically this is a calling tool so like they have created previously and we get some requirement to make some changes on their existing functionality. So like we worked on this one and we made make it successful so that this one is a managed package so they are using internally and let me do, demo you what we have completed in this one so like if i go to a lead and open a lead form here so they have this tool like we can call on this phone number from here and if you make a call from here it will get connected and you can see this is the end call button here so if i am doing the end call call gets and and if i select this position here and make some notes and click on save notes and then again refresh the detail page so we can see like one task is created here which is activity and that was their previous functionality and they were also creating a node here nodes and attachments so a single node and activity were creating like according to their previous functionality and as you can see in this one like they they had some custom fields which they have created previously to get their product uh, assembled at the initial time and then they they have a requirement to like split those fields to from task from the standard object to an, a custom object like the custom field should be split as another custom object so like we have created an custom a custom object here name it daily activity you can see and if someone is going to a lead and making calls all those things then previously what was happening like they were creating an activity and simply nodes were creating there so right now what is happening what we have implemented is like interactive here is an interactivity section and we are also splitting that that task with the interactivity object as well so in Intelli activity object we have all those fields which they have previously custom fields in in their activity object mean activity object and one feature they extra what have is was like uh, they also can go to this Intelliverse tab and there they have some session dialog thing from where they can make call like they can add or modify list from here the list of leads contacts and begin calling from here so if i begin calling from here i have already created list there yeah i can select a lead select a list from here which contains some objects or leads and click on so they, here are the sessions so if i go and click on create session i need to put the name of session 
and if I am creating that, that will contain that lead inside that, and if I need it, I, if I need to start a call from here, so I can start a call. This is a default number. You can put any other number here as well, and click on start. So your session is starting here. Um, it will notify you when the session is started, and then we can a call will make to the your session as a call has been made to the Nitish Madhavan, which is a lead here, and like we can. has started here and like you can end that call from here so if I click on end call and select disposition the same disposition which I have selected in lead and put some note here and click on save notes your notes have been saved and if I get back to this lead QA voice then there will be a created there there will be a task created there and there will be an entirely activity created here like this is the list of 48 so you can view the list and in notes and attachments and notes will be created and an activity will be created so previously they, they were having only the activity and notes so we have added a feature of splitting the task into two objects one is custom object which is having all the custom fields and one is the standard object which is having all the standard fields there and one thing we also have did here is like we added a section of that entirely activity in the section of in detail page of task which is activity so this was all about like which we done for them in this project thank you